but they set the tone this weekend, the mood. He represents the Arctic Figure Skating Club of Canton, Michigan. He comes to us from the Coyote Skating Club of Arizona in Scottsdale, Arizona. Please welcome Jamie Silverstein and Ryan O'Meara. So turn the page now. Belvin and Augusto with 215-29. The gold is sewn up. Forget about it. Gregory Petchikoff for the silver, 185-26, but 174-53. That's the number to remember. Matthews, Zavozin in third place. But Jamie Silverstein, Ryan O'Meara with a chance to overtake them and win the bronze and go to the Olympics. So they weren't concerned to skate after them here in the free dance. They do that every day. turns and great flow. free dance and their serpentine footwork remember that's the footwork that Matthews and Logan fell on near the end so it's important that this really works Excellent difficulty. <laughs> 
Jamie Silverstein and Ryan O'Mara have met the moment. And Belvin and Augusto stayed in the kiss and cry, watched the entire thing. So they met the moment. Are they the bronze medalists? I think with that performance, it would only be fair that they would be. They skated everything perfectly. They had the difficulty in all of the elements. They did not falter. And they expressed this music very well. They're not rushing out to buy their tickets yet to Torino. Not quite sure what the judges will do, but certainly no fall, the mistakes. And if Matthews and Zavosin do lose that bronze and the trip to the Olympics, they have themselves to blame. The fall in the original dance, the fall in the free dance. But we will see when we come back to St. Louis. Singles titles on the line tomorrow or later today if you're on the East Coast. 4 o'clock Eastern on ABC Sports. The men skate for gold, live coverage, and in prime time at 8 Eastern, Sasha Cohen leading the way as the ladies' title will be decided on ABC. Meanwhile, Jamie Silverstein, Ryan O'Mara currently waiting for the marks as we look at their replays, and they, you think they should get that third spot. I do, because they performed this, not only did they perform well, but they had speed throughout the serpentine footwork. Their connection's difficult. Watch how he passes behind her. Turning brackets, a variety. <laughs> their training mates <laughs> certainly feeling their pressure. When you train with people day after day, you get close whether you're competitive or not. You want it for them. And what a long road back for Jamie Silverstein after 99 and 2000, rising star with Justin Pekarek and Anorexia going to Cornell, putting the skates in the trunk, not looking at them. Now she's back with Ryan O'Mara. And maybe going to Italy. We'll see. 49-63, 42 13 Susie. Wow, these are great marks. Not only... That's enough. 178.46, third place there. They know they got it. Pack your bags, get your ticket. You're going to Italy. <laughs> Belvin and Augusto standing and applauding as well. In fact, with that total in the free dance, they actually beat Gregory and Petchikov in that portion of the competition. They finished behind them overall, Susie. Well, unfortunately, Gregory and Petchikov skated well all week, but in the free dance, they made a sprinkling of mistakes throughout. Matthews and Zavosin just not rising, letting the nerves get the best of them. Silverstein and O'Mara, they performed. They, they called it.